I know. Hey, bud. Hey. Can I keep that in? Mm -hmm. I said, hey. Oh, you forgot to tell me. <laughs> Can I keep it? You gonna come in? Thank you, Hello, YouTube. This <laughs> Should I come at him like that? What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Dreadful Kicks coming back to you with another video today. Today, we're just gonna jump right into it, man. We're doing a comparison of two of the dopest shoes to come out this year. Uh, in my opinion, it's like a inspired series that uh, Nike has been doing lately. Nike and Jordan brand, and these two came out this year. So, in y'all opinion, man, I want to see which one is better. So, starting off, we're gonna bust out this Carolina joint. I'm pretty sure y'all have seen these a million one times. But uh, yes, the UNC3, man. Nice tumbled leather on the upper. The elephant print, it looks like it, but it, it pops with that white upper. Carolina blue on the midsole that kind of goes into the white. Super dope shoe. Now on this one, they did it different. They didn't put the tagging on the back. See if I can open this up a little bit so y'all can see it. They put the tagging on the insole. But that's shoe number one with the big bulky uh, <laughs> jump man or whatever. Let's get into uh, the second shoe that dropped. Oh. Now this was a recent release. Uh, these joints, I believe, came out earlier in the year, right before all that Corona stuff hit. So this was probably end of February or that first, second week of March. And then you have this shoe that recently came out, I want to say last weekend, if I'm not mistaken. Today is the 21st, so I believe these did come out last weekend. Uh, dope shoe. The material is it's kind of weird. It, it, it has like a little stroke to it, but I, I honestly don't know what kind of material this is. It, it, I don't know if it's like a really fine new buck or I know it's not suede, but majority green upper man. You got like the smoked out netting on the sides and the uh, tongue standard lacing. You got this smoky uh, tongue with the jump man, and I believe the tongue is 3M. And then it, it does have like this, this cool little pattern. I don't know if you can see it on the insole and on the, the sock liner. It almost kind of reminds you of the wings of the, uh, of the duck. And then on this shoe, it has the inspired patch on the back. But pretty dope shoe overall. Both of them are pretty clean in their own perspective colorways. Uh, in the comment section below, man, let me know which one do you think would take the win in a battle. Would you rather go with the Carolina 3s, UNC 3s, whatever you want to call it, or the Duckman 5s? Uh, it's, it's a lot of variables when you're trying to you know pick one i, I think it, it it depends on first your your colors you know what colors you like second i think it depends on what time of the year it is like i feel like this would be a dope spring shoe summer shoe this one you could get away with it in the summer but you could also rock it like in the fall so it, it really just depends it, you know what's your style so like I said, man, comment section below. Let me know which one you rocking with. Both shoes are dope. That's why I picked them up. And uh, <laughs> other than that, man, it's your boy Dreffel Kicks. I appreciate y'all for watching the video. Make sure y'all hit that like button, subscribe, comment if you haven't already. 
Um, I'm also gonna leak the website, man. I have a limited uh, shipment of some Bears tees that are uh, on the website right now. 2X already showed, so there's a few sizes left. Go check that out. Uh, www.brndapparel.com, but I will link it in the description below. And other than that, man, everybody stay home, stay blessed, and stay out the way. It's your boy, Drop Kids. Oh, wheels, pop me a pill. She want a real. I gave it real.